hey guys it's 1 30 a.m and i'm filming my intro <laughs> So I just realized that I didn't film any type of intro or any of that. I literally just filmed my workouts. So I'm going to film my intro now. So basically, this video is going to be my experience doing the Chloe Ting two-week shred program. Okay, so before we start, I didn't measure myself. Because, like, I feel like I'm not doing this, like, for, like, the actual, like, numbers. And, like, I just... I want to see more of a physical change, like, what I can actually see. Because, like, we can't actually see, like, those little, like, half inches or whatever. So, yeah. And it's, like... And also, like, working out is good for your, like, mental health. So, I'm also doing it just, like... Because I've been kind of stressed or whatever. Because school... Et cetera, et cetera. So, yeah. Quick disclaimer. So, I'm not telling any of you, like, to change how you are, your appearance. Because... Everyone's beautiful in their own way, no matter your body type, your size, or any of that. I just want, like, this video to kind of be, like, inspiration for you guys to, like, maybe work out. Like, honestly, you don't need to change yourself to fit society's beauty because everyone's beautiful in their own way. I don't care about society being freaking annoying, telling people you have to be skinny and you have to be tall. Like, no, no. Everyone's beautiful in their own way. But <clears throat> through this workout, I realized that I will always have little fat on my stomach. You know, like that little like skin that you could just like pinch kind of. Yeah. But you know what? I love my little baby fat rolls. And you guys should love your little baby fat rolls too. So that's that. Everyone needs to just love themselves for who they are. But yeah. So let's just get started. Welcome to voiceover Naomi. So day one was pretty intense. I mean, obviously, because it was the first day. I had no idea what I was doing. I was slipping off the mat and it was just a whole mess. Also, I don't know if I said this in the intro, but my best friend Shanti was being my workout buddy. Shout out to Shanti. So we did this whole workout together, which is why I was bursting out laughing every two seconds. Day two, I was already starting to feel pain on my inner thighs and abs, which made no sense because the first workout was literally 20 minutes. So I was kind of confused, but like, if it hurt, I was just there thinking, this probably means it's working, right? So there was an optional video this day, and you best believed I tried to start it and then got bored and tired and stopped. Day three, I was struggling. I don't know what the heck got into me, but I decided to go on a two mile run and then walked a mile before doing my workouts. So my entire body was hurting and Chloe slapped us in the face with four freaking videos like, girl. Day four, I was so energetic and it felt like the workout was starting to get so much easier. And I was so confused because like it didn't hurt me to work out. But like there were still three whole videos, which was annoying. Day five was a rest day, so you best believe I was eating and sleeping all day. Day six, okay, I got the genius idea of using Sky Zone socks instead of the slippery mat, cause like the bottom of the so socks are sticky, right? And so I worked out with those instead, and like, I'm like a genius, like it's kind of fun, kind of fresh. But like the workouts were getting so much easier.
day seven i was so unmotivated like i didn't want to get out of bed and i definitely didn't want to work out but like i dragged my dead sleep deprived self out of bed and worked out and it was so weird because i had the most random bursts of energy in which i did the exercise at full force but i was so freaking tired day eight oh my god so since our car was broken and like my family needed groceries we went walking for six freaking miles all the way to stop and shop and three miles to come back were freaking with bags full of groceries and i had so much back pain and so working out was really hard and there were four videos like girl day nine was a break day and girl i was happy about it day 10 by then i knew all the songs by heart literally to the t so I was there singing along to what i now call the noise you hear when you enter hell but for some reason my legs hurt so freaking much even though we had a break day right before Day 11, I don't know why I had so much energy and the workout was only 23 minutes and that was great. And it went like so fast and I was so happy. Day 12, I was pretty tired, but the exercises that used to be hard, I was getting through so easily, and I was so proud. But, like, there were four freaking videos again. Like, Chloe made us go from 23 to 45 minutes. Was she trying to do kill us? Day 13, I was so, 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 so freaking exhausted. And I had no energy or motivation to work out. But I thought my outfit was so cute. Like, it really was. And I was so proud of that. Like, that new sports bra, my mom got it for me. And I loved it. But yeah, I was so tired. And it was not it. Hope you're enjoying this program so far. We're done! <sighs> yeah. Okay, wait. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, that's all good. So like I said, it's 1.30 in the morning, so if I sound delusional that's why but this was quite an experience to say the least honestly it was a really long process but i honestly think it was worth it so now that you guys probably had fun making fun of me dying for 10 minutes straight let's talk about the results okay so i had a pretty crazy experience to say the least because i honestly didn't expect myself to like get this kind of results and to stay motivated for like and i honestly expected myself to stop after like three days but like i didn't which is honestly something i'm really proud of so let me guys show you pictures of like the actual like workout how like the change so let me just insert them This is my stomach on day one. So as you guys can see, there wasn't a major change, but like the change is definitely there. And I was, I definitely have like a more defined stomach now. Obviously I'm not an Instagram model, but I'm still proud of myself. Yes, I have some stomach fat, but it's beautiful. You guys are beautiful. I love you. So, okay. Let me just talk a, a little bit about the diet. I feel like your diet is going to affect, like, really affect your res res really affect your results. Like, if you're constantly eating, like, junk or whatever, 
obviously your results aren't going to be as like good and i feel like if you eat like healthier you're obviously gonna get better results but i definitely guys like try this and i really recommend it because it's a reason to get up in the morning and it's like it's it's definitely like a way to stay in shape during quarantine when we don't have anything else to do but i will definitely be trying more of chloe's programs so thank you chloe i love you and um if you guys want to see more of the these like workout challenges feel free to comment down below which ones you'd like me to do because i'll definitely do them like just tell me i will legitimately do them that's how bored i am but like i'm gonna end this video here thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate you guys i love you and i'll see you in my next video